Hi, my name is Julia Spencer Fleming, author of Through the Evil Days. I actually come from a small town. Um, I grew up uh, a military brat and we moved around constantly to large bases. But the place that we always went back to was a tiny town in upstate New York in the area that my fictional town is set in. And that became home for me in a way that a lot of the places that we lived wasn't. And when we got out of the military, we actually uh, settled there for a few years. Uh, very influential years, my preteen years, which I think are a time of life when where you are and what you see and absorb influences you for the rest of your life. I think that people connect to small town mysteries because it touches a part of a, of a memory of what America was. Most of us are not from small towns anymore, but I think a lot of us feel like we're from small towns in the past. We recognize that. We yearn for it in a little, in, to a certain extent. And I think that that touches a deep chord. The perfect elements for a small town mystery. Uh, well, first of all, you need to have a town that is in some way, I think, a little isolated, economically or physically, geographically. Um, it's culturally isolated. I think it helps if you've got a variety of people. The fascinating things about small towns are that they have the same range of personalities, dangers, you know, weirdos, wonderful people as you'd find in any large city, but they're much more closely packed and everyone knows everyone else. So I think it's important to have individuals that everybody, all your readers can recognize and relate to, but also to have a few characters who are a little larger than life because that's what makes reading interesting.